up? It's your boy Bass. Y'all tuned in to another episode of Ends Podcast. Man, y'all know during this whole COVID nineteen quarantine, everybody in the crib, home yeah, safe, or you know, quarantine yourself, man. So you know, artists been dropping music, and one of the latest songs that we got here today is that little baby all in the official video. Y'all can go check it out right now on Ends Music. But we about to you know review it, go over, it, man. You know, lately, you know, baby, little baby been dropping hits. Um, well, singles, videos, uh, off his new album, uh, man, and yeah, y'all heard uh, the review that we did, you know, previously uh, with him and Four Two Doug. Now we about to do one with Little Baby All In. Now it's time to see what it's all about. Now one thing I like about Little Baby, like he got like a new flow to him, you know, like that. He like he represent, you know, that new Atlanta era. Okay, so I already like the song too, though. But but the video, you know, the the video is you know it's that I feel like he represent that that new era Atlanta. Well, you know, cause you know he flashy, but he's still like you know young hustler type guy. You feel me? Like he like it, it it's it's funny cause you know like he flexing, but at the same time he got a white tee on, but you know he got like. A million dollars worth of jewelry, though. You feel me? Then he got, you know, uh, like, <laughs> you know, some luxury uh, shoes on. You feel me? Uh, but they, you know, like, basic, like, all whites, though. Yeah, man. Fun and right here. Hey. <laughs> nah, but uh, this song is real catchy. And I feel like this is one of them, um, like especially like one of them good songs, like for the summer, because it just got like that 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 bounce vibe to it. It's like something you can ride with, something that you can play at a party, you know, something that'll kick back, um, some you know, like just to get the mood right. You know, it got the energy to it. And then we watch the video; it's more so like the same type of, you know, that that same type of vibe too. You feel me? Um, and if you listen to the lyrics. That's pretty much what he's talking about too. Uh, like, basically, like, man, he saying like, man, he, man, he here now, man. Yeah, man. Nah, but you know, when it come down to the video, man, I, I feel like it's it's simple, but it says a lot though. Cause he, you know, like he bringing you like in, you know. And one thing you gonna know about, you know, little baby is he's well invested into his jury game. He's well invested into his jury game. I feel like I was just on another planet. Yeah. So you know, I feel like this is one of them. Um, like it was a simple video, man. But I feel like at the same time, it low key had a message to, to it, you know, because the song is called All In, and you see him showing like a lot of his, uh, you know, his jury. You feel me? He had the crib. You feel me? He got the coin, you know, like he got the quarantine bar with the quarantine mask. You feel me? Him and all his homies, they, you know, they getting their hair cut, you know, lined up. You know, we well, got braids, so you know, he getting lined up. But. You know, and he cleaned off all his jury, but he said like he all in. But if you look, he got a lot of jury, and he like it's real jury because you know he boiling it, like you know cleaning with toothbrushes, boiling it, you know stuff like that. Like, uh, let you know it's, it's real metal, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's real diamonds. They ain't gonna fall out, you know, like nothing like that because he boiling it and nothing like that. Um, so it's like really saying like he all in, like you know. And then you know in the song, he talking about you know push the button on the truck. You see the truck that he talking about, you know, that Rolls Royce, uh, man. Nah, I'm not gonna lie. Um, as one of the 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 newer generation artists, as you know, what a lot of people be saying, um. I feel like he built a strong campaign off of just hard work. And I feel like that's what really like validates 
you feel me, his whole branding, you feel me? Especially when he said like four pockets full, and you know, you talk about being all in. Um, you feel me? This is coming from somebody who dropped, you know, back to back to back to back to back, like mixtapes, you feel me? And like he basically he took that, you know, from him being from Atlanta. I don't know if this where he got it from anything like that, but you know, I can say like, you know, like just growing up watching, you know, Gucci Mane do that, you know, coming out of Atlanta, you know, dropping them back-to-back mixtapes and just really just hitting the market with it um and just steady feeding the streets um, and that's that's really been his thing um and you know man hey ends man eating the streets man we always love to show love to that man and i think his grind is really you know uh understated you feel me uh especially coming from his situation um and then if you really get an understanding of his story, which we also got on Ends Music, you can go watch the documentary uh, that he had. Like, short, it's a short documentary uh, when he first came into the game, uh, The Preacher Man. And just go back and telling his story, like, uh, you know, his dealings with the streets, uh, being incarcerated, then getting out and not really, like, being like a rapper, but being around rappers, because y'all understand how the Atlanta community works. So he was a lot, uh, around a lot of rappers, you feel me, being, you know, like, just shooting dice, you know, stuff like that. Um, but then they were saying like he he has that persona like he has that like you know because he really lived that life you feel me so he has already that persona so if he just started rapping you know it's just all aligned and you know rap it came natural to him uh you hear in his interviews he say like like really him getting in a booth the songs he put out really is his practice so uh yeah so i feel like that also went to um his you know artist development as you see um he just keep getting better and better and better with the songs he's dropping um especially with that mulatto tone and he got that that, that different type of sound um but being able to you know be versatile on you know different type of beats like even though like this had like a like a up like a upbeat to uh like like you know like a more of an upbeat to it but it was still like one of them, uh, you know, like one of them still like hip hop type songs, you feel me? And it was still like, like I could see like, like a, a female can, can, can remix that. Like, you know, or like, you know, take that beat and do something with it. But I feel like, you know, he was able to, to shift it and mold it into, you know, Lil Baby. Um, I feel like that's one of them upbeat type songs. Like I say, like, man, you can have like during the summertime, I always be thinking about like summertime type songs because I like drive around in cars. So I be thinking about songs I like to drive around in car in. That's one of them type of songs. But as far as the video though, I like the video as well. Cause the video really, um, I feel like it really kind of like, kind of like it's simple and really over the top. It don't really like try to amaze you, but he's saying like I'm all in. And I really feel like it was just like a message. Like saying like, man, like this is what we really are. Like y'all can have that over, you know, like, I'm all in, like, <laughs> you feel me? He, Cause he got his young boy with him. I don't know exactly who that was. I don't know if that was a relative or was that, you know, just one of, his, you know, somebody that's part of his crew. But, you know, he had his young guy with him. You know, they both getting lined up in the crib. You know, they got the barber coming by. You feel me? Like he's saying like, I'm all in, you know, and he cleaning his jury and he got a lot of jury. You feel me? And it's, you know, you, you can tell it's a special jury. Um, and then, you know, he was rapping about, you know, the cars and things like that. You see him in the car, but he got his, you know, his, his, his young guy pushing the, the Rolls Royce, <laughs> you know, like the Rolls Royce truck. Um, you know, you feel me? It's like, like, I just commend him on that because that's like new levels. You feel me? Like, just, you know, like having your homie, you feel me? Like your homies get that experience to, you know, know what it's like to like drive a Rolls Royce truck. Like, you feel me? Like, it ain't just you driving it, you know? Um, but you know just long story short i love to hear what y'all got you know from the whole video how y'all feel about the video you feel me how y'all feel about the song you feel me how y'all feel about little baby uh movement and trajectory you know just going forward you feel me so go ahead man voice your opinions man share your voice like as we say man we are the voice of the cultures man so don't be quiet speak up go ahead and you know in them comments or hit that that link in the description where you can leave that voice message. And if you leave a voice message, uh, we will most definitely either shout you out or or have you on the next episode. But it's your boy Bass. Y'all tune in the ends podcast and we tuning out. Don't forget to click that link as well in the description below to go watch that little baby y'all in. It's your boy Bass. We out. 